Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Hellenic Glory, where we have now officially... What? Oh. Apparently we didn't start the siege of Constantinople. I have no idea what we're sieging this time. Okay, I think we're actually sieging Constantinople this time. Whoa. Worrisome. Hmm. Cool. And another... Italian Liberation Revolt. Inspiring leader and flanker seems like a bad combination. Yes, you do that. Uh, ooh, wow, I'm getting a hell of a lot of lag. Oof. That was an odd spike. Actually, my hard drive's making a hell of a lot of noise. I think something's trying to write to it. What are you trying to write to my spare drive, though? Oh, well. Okay, and... Yeah, that should be more than enough. Let them gather up their morale. Alright, so the sieges will continue. With our new Imperial Conquest costs Belize, this is uh, looking much better and much easier. Then afterwards, I think we're going to have to go for the Caliphate. Oh, good. Wife's pregnant already. Let's give the old succession. What? Did they just get more troops while I wasn't looking? I think they did. Those jerks. All right, 15,000. There we are. All right, let's go. Let's put some decent leaders on these. All right, let's go. Shouldn't be too hard. I can just completely smash the crap out of them. I have no idea what Asturias is doing here, by the way. Whatever it is, I just assume it's something related to killing Muslims. That's what they do, right? Pretty much their only job. Kill Muslims. Okay, come on. Drop dead already. Ah. Yeah. Petronella, sure. Good god. Ah, yes. Doge died. Maybe I think I should start working on, like, an economy tech spread or something in my, uh, in Orbito. The number of people who try and loot Rome is ridiculous. And it's silly how much they get anyway, because they can. Alright, enforced demands. Because the fact that they can loot during combat is a little silly. Because of how long combat takes. Even if you instantly stop them, it's almost better to actually just make them run away. Uh, anyway, let's continue our mess building. Western ground, city guard. Let's our training ground two. Sure. Done. Okay, so how it goes over here. Now we'll be breaching the Theodosian walls. You have quite the fort level, I admit that. Amateurish plotter. Well, alright. Marry up then. Another. Ugh. How long will it be until these guys are done? Come on. Hmm. Yeah. Yes, things would be simpler if everything if everybody was Roman. I agree. It's hard to get anybody to be Roman around here, apparently. No, I want to be Italian. Me, me, me. Jerk. 
jerks. Alright. Well, we'll gather up here. Rumors have reached us of a mighty new leader on the rise among the Augurs Turkish tribes of Turkestan. The Khan, by the name of Seljuk, has served armies and steppe hordes, an apparently brilliant commander and inspiring leader of men. He appears to set out to carve his own realm in the region of Turkestan and Kiba. A fine tale. Sultan Seljuk. Well, looks like the first of the hordes is coming. He's actually not that good. He'll be here in a couple of years anyway. I wonder if you just flat out assassinate this guy, what happens? <laughs> Random thought. I mean, he doesn't have a successor, his title should be destroyed. Either way. Castle shipyard, okay. Well, if you're going to build stuff yourself, that's fine too. Don't let me stop you. Can we get universities here yet? Really? Yeah, it's lying at how long it takes to spread tech around. Town infrastructure should be spreading pretty good. And it is. Oh, more tech points, just what I need. Well, might as well upgrade the church. More piety for liege. Good thing to spend money on. Like I said, I may be running out of things to spend money on. May have to start building a large quantity of settlements in Italy and Sicily. We almost done here? Come on, it's only Hagia Sophia. There you go. Hmm. This is really, this, yeah, this really might take a damn long time. I don't think the Emperor's like, the Emperor and the AI can't seem to make peace for some reason. I have no idea why. Sure. You're always allowed to duel, I don't care. So yeah, still no Roman culture on the main peninsula, really. Histria, yeah, Boria, yeah, there, yeah, there, yeah. Oh, uh, well. So damn hard to spread the culture. Four point six every 12 days. Oh yeah, these guys are always good. In a suspicious accident. Yeah, 25. That's a steward and a half there. That's worrying, though. Suspicious accident. Okay, collect taxes. Yeah, you know what? Research economy tech in Orbitello. That's 125% spread rate. Perfect. The Turkish gods are strong. Yay, more diplomacy. I'm actually starting to get a diplomacy score now. My base score just keeps climbing, which is always useful. <laughs> and good, the wife's prego again. Always useful. Yeah, the Byzantines are starting to gather together an army that I need to be a little worried about, I suppose. City walls, level 2. Yeah, okay, so general, general uh, defenses across the board. No weak points. Shouldn't take too long. No. Stop trying to free various friggin' prisoners. The only people who are in my dungeons really are people who are, like, revolted anyway. Sympathizer. He should join him. Ooh, charitability. Anyway, level 3 castle shipyard. That should be the final upgrade for my castle, actually. I've completely neglected the others, though. Hmm, suppose so. Castle walls. Castle walls. Get some more fortifications going around here. Cities don't even have any fortifications, because they're so cheap I don't want to build them. <laughs> I have too much money. I believe I went over just why I switched over to a feudal monarchy in the first place, which was to stop myself from having too much money. But, as we can see, switching into a theocracy ended up just bringing the problem up again. Ooh, geez, that's a significantly strong set of troops there.
I doubt we'll have enough time to get enough men to him. What can we get out here? Oh dear. Um... Vigilus. Um... Octavius. Probably spelt that wrong. Go, go, go. Just get whatever aid we got to it. Ooh, wow. We're crushing him. That's going incredibly well. That's a crippling defeat. I thought I was in trouble for a second there. Eh, whatever. I care less the boats make it, but... Good job, men. And with 97, this is 100. Yeah, you won't make peace, oddly. And I don't think the AI knows how to properly enforce demands. I'll be taking that. What did I just usurp it? Ugh. Yeah, keep provoking stuff, damn it. And Kona is converted. Huzzah! All right, things are going well here. Really pushing the Catholics out. And yeah, the uh, incuminatural patriarch is now my bitch. Now, if only I could actually revoke his... I'm still going to revoke his, uh... Title there. He's still going to be, um... What do you call it? My vassal, so... It's irrelevant, I just happen to have the orthodox vassal under my control now. Anyway... Revoke the County of Thrake. Alright, drop. Grant Light a title, the Duchy of Thrake. Done. Boom. That's Constantinople. Huzzah, huzzah, huzzah. Huh? Hmm? Oh, yeah. Right, this is going on. <laughs> I totally didn't blank at all on that. Eh, he needs... I'm sure someone will educate him. Someone always comes along for that. Anyway, finish off this revolt. Perfect. <clears throat> anyway, so now we've got a whole pile more area. Yeah, I figured we'd be able to get some more retinues. Rashka. Still haven't even taken the actual county of it. Uh, how many more of these can we grab? Just two? Well, two's better than none. Buildings. Mustering grounds four. Oh, damn it, I keep clicking on that stuff. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to start building more holdings again. Could finish Sicily off. We need cities. Oh, I actually ran out of cash. Ah, my half brother. Cool. Anyway, we'll drop these ships as well. Thry Thrace and Constantinople are now under our control. So is the Incuminati Patriarch. Suck it, Byzantium. You lose. You lose. I win. I win. What? That comes up as us. The theocracy of Constantinople is coming up as a crescent moon. I think that's a glitch. That seems like something that would happen if it was controlled by Muslims. Or maybe I'm just equated as the same as a Muslim at this point. Honestly, I wouldn't blame them. I've come conquered everything they've known and loved. And gonna keep conquering everything that they know and love for probably quite some time. 
Speaking of which, when does Durachian fall out of uh, Greece? <laughs> I need to check that one. 34, I got a long time for that. <laughs> anyway, I'd like to thank everyone for watching. This has been another successful episode where we've conquered Constantinople. I think next episode we will, yeah, Rashka, Zeta, and Durachian. Triple, triple go our way in, take Chaldike even, maybe. That'd be nice. And uh, connect up our little land. Here, at least. We'll still need Adrianopolis to uh, fully do that. Um, how the hell they still have Mosea? I don't know. Yeah, I think the Byzantine Empire is cheating, guys. Just saying. I think they're cheating or something. Don't know how, but I think they're cheating. <laughs> anyway, uh, so yes, thank you everyone for watching. As always, this has been Emperor Julius now of the Grand Roman Empire. Signing off.